Hey guys, how's it going? So today I am filming a pack with me. I am actually seeing my long distance boyfriend in two days. I am going to Toronto where he lives to go visit him. I have not seen him in about three months or so. So I'm super excited to see him. It's been a while. It's definitely a well needed trip. Um, he is in medical school right now, so I don't get to see him until he gets, goes on breaks. So he's on a break right now or coming up in a few days. So I'm just going to go visit him and it will be a lot of fun. So I thought, why not video a pack with me? So a pack with me is just basically me showing you exactly what I'm packing for my trip to give you ideas to see what maybe you would want to bring on a trip see the products I'm using, the clothes I'm wearing, all that fun stuff because usually you take your best stuff on a trip. So this is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm so excited for the trip, so stay tuned for vlogs about the trip. But other than that, I'm gonna show you exactly what I'm bringing with me um, to go up to Toronto. I live in Michigan, so it's a bit of a journey. It's like a three hour drive about, three or four hours. So let's do this and let's see what I'm bringing. So basically, I'm just bringing everything in this travel bag. It's really cute, gray and white stripes, my aesthetic. Um, it comes with a carry-on handle or like a over-the-shoulder handle and also has the straps with it. Inside, um, I just got this from Target. It's the Morona brand. It has one pocket, which is nice. I can throw like my jewelry and stuff in there. And then I'm going to pack everything into this main compartment. And I'll probably bring a backpack too, just to put um, all of my beauty items and stuff, which is right here. Um, but first, I will show you all of the clothing I'm bringing. So first, I'm bringing this um, shirt. It's really cute. It is, you probably have seen it in my vlog, um, my pool day vlog, but, um, this is just a button-down shirt. It's like oversized, long, it has slits. It's really cute. Then I'm bringing my Distressed Gap Denim um, shorts. I really like these. They are super comfortable and super like relaxed since they're so long. I don't have to worry about anything showing or coming out. These are just amazing and I love them. They are so comfortable. I'm also going to be bringing this Ann Taylor Loft little blouse um, just in case I need it. It's like a softened boyfriend blouse. Pretty basic, has a collar. As you can see, I'm into the like loose collar trends with the light fabrics. This is in a pretty like floral um, pattern. I really like this. It has like light blue and black in it. It's just really basic, but I'm gonna wear this with the shorts or the red one, I haven't decided yet. Next, we are going to Toronto, downtown Toronto for the day. So I'm bringing this shirt by Roots. Um, if you know anything about Canada, you guys know that Roots is like their main store where everybody shops at. And I have a few things from there for my boyfriend and stuff that I've bought in while I'm traveling there. So this is just a Bush League shirt. I really like it. I think it's cute. I like what it says. Um, my boyfriend played hockey in college, so I'm used to the, you know, Bush League saying or whatever. And then these are just a pair of black joggers. They're just comfy. They have zippered pockets, drawstring, pretty basic. But I thought this with my tennis shoes that I'm going to show you in a moment will look really, really cute. Um, next, I am bringing my Lily Pulitzer, which this is not really Canada, but I think it's cute. It's like an off-the-shoulder little um, tunic tee. It's three-quarter length sleeve, the pretty print, and then the bottom has this really pretty frayed detailing, which I like. And then I'm going to wear this with my H&M jeans. If you saw my H&M haul, I will link that up above. But these are just um, distressed little ankle flare jeans. They are high-waisted, so I thought this with the off-the-shoulder top would give it a cute, like, boho, summery vibe with the light wash denim. I thought it would be super, super cute. And then I'm also bringing just a pair of Old Navy high-waisted capri pants. These are just like workout um, reflective running gear, but I'm going to wear these on the way home, I think, um, with like a t-shirt that I slept in probably. I'll just re-wear the t-shirt or if I have extra, which I probably will because I always overpack. I'm just going to bring these. 
And then as far as pajamas go, I'm bringing this Nike shorts with this t-shirt, which I can also wear out in public if need be. I'm wearing these Madewell shorts. These are super cute. I love these. These are from Madewell with my Georgia Go Dogs. As you can see, Go Dogs with this t-shirt because it has like gray writing in it. So I think that looks cute with that. And then next I have my LuLaRoe um, little pink mauve leggings that I'm going to wear with my Adidas oversized t-shirt. So that's my pajamas for another night. So yes, that is basically all the clothes that I'm bringing. Next I'm going to show you the shoes that I'm going to be bringing. Now I'm not going any doing anything crazy. I'm just bringing casual tennis shoes with me. And if you've seen my haul, which should be up before this, I believe it's a clothing haul. Um, you will have seen these shoes before and they are super cute. I will link that up above as well. But I'm going to show you what those are really quickly and they will look really cute with my outfit. So the first pair of shoes that I'm going to be bringing are my Old Navy little sneakers. These are super cute and comfortable. Um, I haven't worn them out yet, but they feel comfortable when I try them on. So hopefully they are. They're super cute. They're like a faux suede and they are just adorable. They are just adorable and super perfect to walk around downtown Toronto. I'm also going to be bringing these rose-colored Reeboks. Um, these might be comfier than the Old Navy ones, so I'm going to bring these just in case. Not exactly sure. haven't worn these either, but I'm going to be doing that. And then I'm probably going to bring one pair of sandals, and that's about it. Um, these are the shoes I'm going to wear. And then the one pair of sandals that I'm going to bring. About to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't know about to see the world in action so next off i'm gonna show you exactly what i'm bringing in terms of makeup skincare all that stuff so i have i'm not bringing a lot this time i think i'm gonna go mostly natural <laughs> i've been doing that a lot this summer to let my skin um just breathe a little bit help with my acne and it's getting a lot better so i'm probably gonna just keep doing this but i did bring some makeup if we go on a date night or when we go out to toronto i'll probably wear some makeup then so I thought it would be fun to just show you what I'm bringing, what products I'm using, some of my faves and my go-tos. So this is like a August favorites and a pack with me all in one. So let's see what I grabbed. So first off, I'm keeping all my makeup in this little Hoola Benefit um, little compart compartment or whatever package <laughs> that I got for free from Hoola Beauty or Benefit. And um, so in here, I'm just keeping a few, few items, some of my favorites. I have a blush brush, a highlighter brush, and I have the Wet n Wild highlighter in Precious Petals. I'm really liking this highlighter right now, if it would ever focus. But um, it is in the color Precious Petals. It's really pretty. I'm also bringing my Tarte Shape Tape. This is my Ride or Die Concealer. I use the color light and then I also have a little um, eyeshadow brush that I'm going to be using with this this is actually a blush from NYX it is in the color Beach Babe it is absolutely beautiful um, so I'm going to be bringing this and I use this actually as an eyeshadow and a blush so it's kind of multi-purpose which is awesome when you're traveling um, I'm also bringing my It Cosmetic CC Cream. This stuff is awesome. There's SPF 50 plus in it. So this is definitely good for days when we're spent out by the sun. He also has a pool, so I might be going swimming. I just don't know what's going to go on. So um, I'm bringing that as well. And then I'm bringing two mascaras. I'm bringing my Ride or Die L'Oreal Voluminous. Um, this is a favorite for sure. This is really good. And then this new one that I've been trying is um, by Essence at Ulta. It's Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. This stuff is so pretty on. It is amazing and I think it costs like six bucks. So this is a really good mascara if you are in the market for one, but the L'Oreal Voluminous is also my ride or die. So that's always a good one. So yeah, that's basically all the products I'm bringing. I'm just bringing the CC cream, a blush, mascara, highlight, and some eyeshadow from the same blush. 
And that's basically, oh, I also have my NARS blush in here, which I don't know if I'll be using, but this is in the color Orgasm. Um, this is just, you know, like everybody's ride or die, but if I want more of a pinky um, blush instead of the uh, kind of bronze look that the NYX one gives, I will be using this NARS one. So that is all I'm bringing for makeup. Next, let's move on to skincare and just hygienic items. Next up, I have this little cosmetics bag from Target. I love the print of it. It reminds me of Canada, so I always bring it when I go to Canada. But it's super cute. I got this in like the dollar spot section. I think it was like three or five dollars. I think it was only three bucks. So it's super cute. I put usually all like my bath items, my toiletry items in here. And I'm bringing my Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water because this stuff is a necessity to take off my makeup and my CC cream and stuff. This stuff is amazing and it just this helps cleanse my face as well, keeps me from breaking out, so I love this stuff. And this is actually my deodorant. It is a deodorant that doesn't have, um, it's natural, hypoallergenic, ultra pure, and long lasting. I love this. It's from the Honest Company, and it is just a, um, spray deodorant. I got it on clearance from Marshalls for like three bucks and this stuff is smells so good. It works amazing so I really like this stuff. Next in here I have a L'Occitane travel size shower gel. I'm going to be bringing this so I can use it as my soap in the shower. I'm also bringing some massage oil. This is from the body shop because I owe my boyfriend a massage. He's been working really hard in medical school, so maybe he deserves one. We'll see. And then um, I also got this Trader Joe's Enrich Moisturizing Face Lotion. I love this stuff. It has SPF 15 in it, which isn't too much, but I just like using this after I get out of the shower and before I go to bed. It's a really good um, basic moisturizer that I enjoy. This is a L'Occitane shampoo, trial size. I'm going to be bringing this to just use shampoo. I'm not bringing any conditioner or anything, keeping it super basic, and I'm just bringing this shampoo with me. Next up in this bag, uh-oh, I think something spilled, but I'm just bringing these simple cleansing wipes. I got this in my Target um, Beauty Box unboxing, so I will link that up above as well, but um, this is just cleansing wipes, so I'm going to be using this to remove my makeup as well as the micellar cleansing water. I also have a Just Bath and Body Works Warm Vanilla Sugar Lotion that I can use on my body and my hands because my hands get super dry. So this will be good to have. I just keep that in there. I have some band-aids in case I need them. Also have a little pack of travel size Q-tips. I have some cotton rounds to use for my micellar cleansing water because my boyfriend does not have any of this stuff. I also have the Origins Plant Scription Anti-Aging Cleanser in case I want to cleanse my face in the shower as well. Sometimes the micellar cleansing water doesn't do a good enough job of taking off all my makeup, so in the shower I like to use a cleanser too. That one's one of my favorites. It's really, really good. Next up, I have my Viva La Juicy taking it back old school. This perfume smells amazing. I don't care what anybody says, if it's old or weird or whatever. This is just a travel size roller ball and I love this, so I'm bringing this with me. I also have a Bliss Body Butter. This is just a travel size lotion. Um, this is gonna be for my body after I shower and stuff, so I have plenty of lotion. And then last but not least, I'm just bringing some wet ones. You never know when you're going to need these. I like to keep these in my purse, so I always have them. So I'm going to be bringing this with me as well. So that is basically everything I'm bringing with me to Toronto. I hope you guys enjoyed this little pack with me video and found it helpful in some way. If maybe you're going on a trip soon or you just enjoy watching these, I know these are kind of fun to see how other people pack and what they bring with them on vacation. So I hope you enjoyed it. Obviously, I'm bringing a few other items. I'm bringing my phone, my charger, my purse with my wallet and all of that stuff like money and chapstick and stuff like that. So I'll have that all in my normal purse but this is basically everything that I'm bringing with me so I thought it would be fun to show you guys and I hope you really enjoyed it so I'll see you guys next time XOXO